Okay, welcome to um, Unboxing Roulette number four, or it should be number three, but this is technically number four because we're doing Return to Rev. Well, Return to Rev Nika. We have done one box of this before, but um, as I mentioned in the battle for Zendikar 1, it got halfway through and stopped. So hence, uh, we only did half a box and we didn't really get to um, destroy anything we really wanted to destroy. <laughs> so we thought we'd do it again. And also I didn't get a single abrupt decay. And that's what I'm after for, for my elf deck. So uh, with me again is, with me again is Stubbs. Hello. Um, and yeah. So, Stubbs, what are you looking to destroy in this one? What are you uh, hoping for? I'm still wanting to destroy that Sphinx relation. Yeah, and I'm, I'm still after the Supreme Verdict. Um, we didn't... I th we got a Supreme last time, didn't we? Uh, I think we cracked one. We yeah, didn't get, to, didn't get destroyed. It didn't go the water, but no. this is a whole new one. So, as always, we have um, fresh box, not opened. Um, every fourth rare or foil will be destroyed. We have the water. It's not paint filled the way it was last time. Um, we are doing this live in our local game shop, so there is a bit of background noise. And yeah, let's go. Any time today. <laughs> they get harder the older they get. Yeah. <laughs> okay. It's a pretty box though at least. It is, it was a nice set. I'm just going to see if I can do this. For those that I mentioned before our store did the Eternal Masters, um, I might show that. So over here, the Eternal Masters token, there's every single one of them in all its glory. Now we're just waiting for someone to come in and mess them all up on us. So that we can because cry a lot. It took a long time to do. <laughs> um, okay, so first one. God. Swift Justice. Niv Majus. Eh. Yeah. <laughs> safe. Crap, but safe. Disappointing. Disappointing. Yeah. I think I saw a foil. Saw a foil? Well, I think safe. I saw it. It's safe. What do we got? Oh, oh there's the Supreme. Not and it's, it's, it survives. And, that sucks. and a foil Tristani. Foil Tristani. That's um, solid. That's very nice. But what that means is next card. the next card is gone. Now we have a foil Tristani and a Supreme out of the first two packs. So, so far, we're going pretty well. So, what will be destroyed? Oh. Detention sphere. Still, still blue white. Yeah. So I'll take that as a win. <laughs> putting that in the water. It's that that proper rotation for uh, for being yeah. destroyed. Yeah. And the first card there is the Drudge Beetle. Yeah. Scavenger I always thought was an underwhelming mechanic. Uh, it's yeah. It's something that if it's there and you can use it, then fine. But you can't build around it. Or yeah. Or not, not so bad for the sealed format, but otherwise. But who plays green black anyway? Well, I can think of at least three people. <laughs> Dreadball. Dreadball. It's not a bad card at all. Yeah, in the last in the last box there was a foil Dreadball that survived yeah. the chop. Yeah, that was about the one decent card we got in the pack. Well, the good news is last time you, you destroyed a Trustani, now you've got a foil one. Yeah. So. <laughs> uh, so we have... Oh, Temple Garden. Ooh, nice. Now, I did. I had looked the other day, and in all these boxes, out of I think it's about 12, 10 or twelve dual color rare lands. Yeah. Only one has been destroyed. Oh, really? The same as I think we've cracked five. I've cracked five planeswalkers and have yet to destroy one. That's so. <laughs> so at a, some point, you're building up some exactly, really bad luck. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> so what have we got here? This one is destroyed. Underworld, uh, Underworld and that one's safe. That's our first one. Oh, just put stuff on my plane. That's oh, stuff. Well, that's fine. You know, it's it's an aquatic plane mat, isn't it? <laughs> it's you know it's meant to be wet. I chose these play mats because we've got the land one and the ocean one. This is Australia, as they run, who lives in Australia or visits Australia knows. Everything over here is trying to kill us. Even the platypus, even the kangaroos. Seriously though, that, that koala looks like he's on steroids. <laughs> it's, it's ridiculous. 
So, what do we have? Corpse Jack Mouse. Not a green black one. Yeah, this was my first ever pre-release. I had never played Magic until until I think a week before this pre-release, and I had no idea what I was doing. <laughs> that, makes, that makes pre-releases better, though. <laughs> I still have no idea what I'm doing. But... Ooh, if you need it. Very nice. <laughs> Might have heard Dean in the background then. He's um, a 40 card purist in sealed decks. Oh. And I like to go to 42. 42 is oh. my sweet spot. And it drives him crazy. It drives time. a lot of us crazy. <laughs> so this one is destroyed. We have. Oh, Pack Rat. Oh, I like Pack Rat. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> he was so broken. That, that, was, so that was hard for you, but if it had been me, it would have been very easy. <laughs> Even now in Commander, you see a pack rat and it's just like, burn it, burn yeah. it quickly. <laughs> Kill it with fire. <laughs> so once again, the first of our safe cards. <laughs> Kill feud. Awesome! So happy that one's safe. <laughs> Do you want to swap that with the pack rat, baby? I can retire now. It's, on it's only a little wet. <laughs> <laughs> We've got people cringing around the store. With it's beautiful. Cards in there. This makes me enjoy it even more. <laughs> um, they'll go Second jump. Oh, and once again, dodging of bullets. Oh, tip it over. The Blood Crip survives. And. Oh, Foil Planes. So the next one's gone. I might just have to. I almost had a. So I might have to rearrange this a bit to make it a bit sturdier. There we go. Alright, so. This one's in the drink. Yeah. What do we got? Come on, the Sphinxes. Oh, it's blue white. Oh, oh Rakdos Return. I like that, and I'm not a red black. That's not player. a bad card, actually. I I'm, quite enjoy it. Yeah. I've got him in my budget commander deck, too. Actually, I don't. <laughs> Maybe I need one. <laughs> no, nah, it's in there. It's gone. <laughs> Hang on, if it's... I'll just... I'll it's, fix it a little bit for you. It's just a little air... It's just a little waterlogged. It's still good. It's still How's good. that uh, detention spear going? <laughs> yeah. Getting nice and waterlogged. Yeah. Soaking through nice nicely. Soft now, too. Yeah. <laughs> you just have to marinate these things for a while. And I'm glad that's water going on my play map there, stuff. Oh, that's... It's <laughs> all good, it's only water, mate. It's not going to do anything. Oh, another quality card saved from the water. <laughs> I'm just... You can't complain when you're saving fetch lands. Uh, shock lands, that's... So, second rare. Oh, my shock card. So I'm just trying to track down the cards that... Oh, another Trostahani. <laughs> he just he apparently likes to show up in these, in these boxes. Is it a he? Is it a he? Oh, I thought it was. I don't, I don't know. Yeah, it is. <laughs> there we go. Okay, I was... I, I always thought otherwise. So... Uh, so this one is safe. So the rare is safe. Well, Beastmaster, he's okay and sealed. Yeah. Nothing special though. Yeah. And this one's destroyed. Uh, <laughs> So still no Supreme, still no Sphinxes. No. Oh, volatile rig. <laughs> Not upset at all. <laughs> no, no great loss. <laughs> we haven't really done anything big this time, have we yet? Let's see what we've got. Not really. What else is in there? Pack rat, I guess, a little bit. Yeah, last time we had a chromatic lantern and a few other things. So here's here's a list of the um from our previous this is what water does to it by the way. Um, so we had the Trustani, we had, um, what else did we have? Chromatic Lantern, Epic Experiment. See, I don't know about you, but I'd still play these. I think they're fine. <laughs> they're still good. They're fine. I'll take them down to the GP and trade them in. That's a um, solid win con for my commander deck. 
you laugh, but wait to the budget commander and we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> so, precinct captain is safe, as is a foil frostburn. Nice. I always like frostburn as a card. He's a cool card. And yeah. when, uh, as much as I hate to say it, as much when Devotion was, the blue was around, yeah. he found a really solid home. Yeah. Even though I hated that. <laughs> Devotion was a good. I, I didn't mind it as a mechanic. I just don't think they thought it through as well as they could. Have. They just they gave it to us in a format where we had enough to power it over the top. Yeah. Um, and of course, you know, only the two colours that were being played, the two colours that were being played with both had very good outs. Yes. Very very good outs. Generating mana above and beyond what they should be able to do as well with their lands. Oh, this one's destroyed. <laughs> Cyclonic Rift. Again, I'm not sad to see it go. <laughs> I, can, I can see the pain on your face, but uh, I, I like it as a card. I like it as a card, <laughs> but it's gone. Cyclonic Rift. <laughs> All right, so our first safe one. <clears throat> oh, Vraska. Nice. <laughs> Do you remember the price of her when she first came out? Uh, no. She was a $70 card. Whoa. At pre-release time. Whoa. And this was back before the time of really expensive. She was, she was $70. $70. That's, yep. That's incredible. Then she went down to about $1.50. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think she's back up to four or five now, but... Yeah, yeah I mean... Oh, that's the one I wanted to destroy. <laughs> Lol troll. Maybe put Not it on the side. <laughs> I think I might destroy that one later anyway. <laughs> Be like the <laughs> siege rhino from the other day. <laughs> Just a little bit. Okay, so <laughs> onto our card that's being destroyed now. What is it? Oh, it's blue white. It's blue white. Oh, Archon. Uh, you know, it's blue white though, so Sphinx. it can go in. I, I don't mind. <laughs> It's a Sphinx. Anything of blue-white is pretty happy to just go in. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of with there. The, the poor Azorus killed, I just really didn't like them at all. <laughs> yeah. With their laws and their rules and whatnot. Yeah, I was always <laughs> Celeste now. Green-white all the way. <laughs> I think I was much more of a gruel player. Always into the red-green. Green. One of the good things about this is I love the um, the uncommons. There was some strong up with the charms and the, there's a lot of yeah. and, the, and the guild mages and there was a lot of strong uncommons. There's a strong rare for you. Mm. Actually, is seen combo play now in commander decks. Yeah. Uh, the um, the blue red commander Niv uh, oh, Nivix. Yeah. Because he goes and finds you yeah, at one, three, two, three costs, then it's your, your three pieces normally, so... Yeah, and away you go. Yeah. Yeah, but who plays blue and commander, right? Everyone. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so this one's safe. Desecration demon. Yeah. And then there's a foil which will go into the water. Oh! Mizium oh, oh. waters! Oh! Ooh, that hurts. Oh. That hurts a bit. Foil Mizzy and Mortars in a gaze. That's, um, that's, that's, I'm upset about that. Uh, <laughs> we might need to stop and have a second to recuperate here. That's, uh, wow. That, that, was, that ruled the format for a while, Mizzy and Mortars. It was just the removal you went to. Oh, it's a brilliant card. Ethereal Armor. Yeah, Such a another good card. nice card. It's a great card, isn't it, Sean? <laughs> we had big arguments over that. He was right, though. It needed to find a place, and it finally did. Yeah. Found a place to play on a modern deck. Yep. I actually play that. That's my modern deck of choice. Another card that was very underplayed. Yeah. But I really liked it. Yeah. It's a dragon. They go raw. It has the word hypersonic in its name, and I just really <laughs> like saying that. <laughs> It's almost worth getting like a Spanish version of that just to see what it, because it probably sound really cool. <laughs> so the next one is safe. Oh, Steam vents, and again, the rare land survives. 
That's three of them. I, I think at this point they have to because the, <laughs> the foil Ms. Mortars. That's. Uh, <laughs> Ouch. Yeah. <laughs> what else do we get? Oh, yeah, pack rat. It is going to get three hours Detention sphere. Oh. Well, you know. You get a normal one. <laughs> <laughs> At least you still have the card. That's yeah. <laughs> it's not shiny. It doesn't Quick, make cool. over yeah. <laughs> um, I think we might be a little bit past that. Point. I think I might be. <laughs> uh, so this one is gone, and it is. Can it be the first planeswalker? Nah, grave betrayal. Eh. Who plays with the graveyard, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I would really like to put a Jace in there. Into the stuff. Jace was just everywhere for about a year and a half. It just got annoying. Which Jace was in this one? Um, the the four cost uh, draw. Oh, that's right. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. What's he? Which one was he? Um, uh, minus two was bad. Plus one was all creatures to minus one minus one yeah. attack. Architect of thought. That's the one. Oh, Rector Skillgate. They're pretty for Commander. They are pretty. Yeah. Looks nice in foil as well. Yeah. Rakdos always did look good in foil. It's because they had a lot of that cathedral yes. and, and yeah. fire hellbent stuff, so... Pretty cool. Okay. So, we're up to the third one. Havoc Festival. Yeah. Sorry, fell asleep a bit there cracking that card. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be too, too excited. <laughs> so next one's gone. Come on, Jace. I can feel it. It's a foil force of will. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Oh. oh. <laughs> uh, the good news is though, the foil guild mage, he's safe. Yeah, the epic <laughs> experiment. And for the one we did previously, that's the epic experiment we put in the water from last time. <laughs> I don't want to put him with his brother. Yeah, I'll put him in with his, with his friend. There you go. Twinsies. I bet not, because that way we'll uh, leave him with his... Yeah, you've just contaminated the pile. I know, now. right. floaties going on. So epic experiment apparently loves going for a swim. <laughs> well, it's cool. So, what are we up to? Uh, Second one. card. Then we get our first one in the guild mage. Yeah, Jared's orders. Yeah. Yeah, we had one then last time too. We did. And from memory, you wanted to put it in the water. I did. Because of a particular player in the shop. Yeah, Dan. Hi, yeah. Dan. It's actually here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a third card. Oh, it locks it on. Not a bad one. Which means the next one's gone. What will it be? Obviously, abrupt decay. <laughs> we haven't had. A, I just need an abrupt decay. And you I'll only need to find is. one, and I'll bet you tear. Yeah. No. 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 What was it? Carnival Hellstein. Oh no. Yeah. So as I said in the last one, um, the last card also will get destroyed. Oh, so, we're going to destroy this one as well. Yeah, whatever the last one is. Ooh. Goes in the drink. Okay. Otherwise, the last pack's a bit of an end. Well, yeah. It's, it's like, oh, we're done. What's, what's safe? This one will be the foil of Rock Decay then. As long as there's a normal Rock Decay before yeah, it, I'll be happy. Nice and slow so that we uh, get to see. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's anticlimactic. <laughs> in all honesty, I was looking, thinking, okay, where's the rare? You still on <laughs> Uh, Chaos Sim, so it's a yeah. very, very disappointing card, but uh, quite happily in the water. So, um, <laughs> there we have it. They're the destroyed ones. Um, they'll be just so people don't think we're going to. There. Yeah, fourth one. So they're gone, and now I'm doing it to my own play, Matt. <laughs> so, everything that was safe there as well. So. That's what we saved. So. Can't really see, you're going down the wrong way. What have I done? Do them the other way, that way we can see the names. No. Oh. <laughs> and then I just do this for you. Yeah. 
So no real big money saved. Um, well, I mean, Foil Tristani's not bad. Foil Tristani. All, all the um, shock lands is good. Yeah. But nothing, nothing like I, I think we definitely had the luckiest side of it saved rather than destroyed again. Which seems to be a theme. You know you want to do it. No, it's not the rules. I can't do it. As much as I want to. Supreme survives. Which it did for a year and a half. Yeah. <laughs> well, thanks, Dubs. And thanks, everyone, for listening. And the next one, um, I think I might do um, one of the Theros block. Maybe Born of the Gods, just to see if there is actually anything worthwhile in that Yeah. Set. Um, and, and just wait until you put that one brim as you will get into the drink. Yeah. <laughs> so thanks, thanks again for listening and subscribe. And, yeah, see you next one.